Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu is a martial art that is based on the principle that, using a certain technique, it is possible to defeat an enemy that is superior in strength and size. And today, I'm going to tell you about Mackenzie Dern, the famous Brazilian-American Jiu-Jitsu champion who uses her skills in the mixed fight octagon. You are on the channel 100 Years of Sports and we are starting. Mackenzie was born in March 1993 in Phoenix, Arizona and was introduced to the world of martial arts at a young age through her parents. Her father, Wellington Megaton Diaz, is a renowned Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu practitioner and world champion in the sport. And her stepmother, Luciana Tavares, is a black belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu and has competed in numerous tournaments. Growing up in such a family, Mackenzie was introduced to the martial arts at the age of three. Mackenzie Dern spent her childhood traveling with her parents to various tournaments and competitions around the world. Their influence and the mentorship of her parents played a significant role in her development as a martial artist. Mackenzie began competing in local Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu tournaments at the age of six and quickly gained recognition as a talented young athlete. While continuing to train under her father and other world-class trainers, Dern honed her skills and prepared for a career in the martial arts. Since her first training, Mackenzie has become a world champion in every belt level before earning a black belt. And then she won gold at the black belt level in all the major, highest ranking championships, becoming the only jiu-jitsu athlete to achieve this. But Dern considers his main victory in jiu-jitsu to be the victory over Gabby Garcia, who was almost twice her weight, proving to everyone that no one can resist good technology. But Mackenzie's great jiu-jitsu career was not enough. And in the summer of 2016, she made her debut in the Legacy Fighting Alliance, LFA. Her first opponent was Kenya Roses, who was declared the loser by unanimous decision. But already in the next fight, Mackenzie showed all her skills acquired over the years of competition in jiu-jitsu and in the first round ended the fight with Montana de la Rosa by choke. The jiu-jitsu experience gave Dern a significant lead in the LFA, and she quickly won all four fights in that organization. In March 2018, after a single but victorious fight in the Invicta FC promotion, Mackenzie made her debut in the UFC. In the first fight, she defeated Ashley Yoder, and a couple of months later she took on the choke Amanda Cooper, thus bringing her score to seven wins in seven fights. Then Mackenzie had to take a break in his career, which I will talk about in more detail later. Returning to the Octagon in October 2019, Dern stumbled upon Amanda Rebus, who gave her the first defeat in her fighter career. Mackenzie realized that the break had taken a toll on her technique and stepped up her training. And in May of the following year, the efforts paid off. In the fight with Hannah Cyphers, Mackenzie used a knee bar, a painful hold aimed at the knee, and Hannah was left with no other option but to give up. Dern thus became the first woman in UFC history to win using any form of leg blocking. Over the course of her mixed martial arts career, Dern has amassed an impressive record of 12 wins and just three losses, with eight of her victories by submission. On May 13, 2023, McKenzie will face Angela Hill. The fight will take place at the UFC on ABC4 tournament. Angela has 27 fights behind her, of which she won only 15 and only five by submission. So I think McKenzie can easily handle it. Away from the mats and the octagon, Dern has had a tumultuous personal life. She was married to professional surfer Wesley Santos, the couple divorced in 2022. In June 2019, Mackenzie gave birth to her first child. It was in anticipation of her first child that she took a break from her career. The girl was named Moa. Dern has been open about the challenges of balancing career and motherhood, but she's managed to excel in both areas. Mackenzie Dern's career is the result of her upbringing in a family of martial artists, combined with her natural talent and relentless training, which has made her one of the best fighters in the world. Her wrestling skills set her apart from other mixed martial artists and she has established herself as an athlete to be reckoned with. 
And with no plans to retire, Mackenzie continues to inspire fans around the world with her impressive skills and unwavering determination. Do not forget to write comments, put likes and subscribe to the channel, they talk about sports here.